Hi, I'm Dave with AutoZone. Let's talk about brake fluid. An essential part of the brake system maintenance is checking your brake fluid. Keep your brakes operating effectively by learning to check your brake fluid and the common signs that you need to refill your brake master cylinder reservoir. Low brake fluid can dramatically reduce the effectiveness of your brakes. If you experience a spongy feeling while pressuring your brakes, they aren't working properly. Low contaminated fluid could cause brakes to fail while on the road. How to check your brake fluid. One, find the brake master cylinder reservoir, typically a plastic canister mounted near the firewall at the rear of the engine compartment. Older vehicles have a metal reservoir with a clamp securing the lid. Two, inspect your fluid level. Check to see it's at its recommended fill level. If not, it may need to be refilled. Worn out brake pads can cause low levels, so inspect pads or ask a professional. Three, inspect your fluid color. Inspect the color of your fluid, even if it's at the right level. Dark fluid could have contaminants. How to add brake fluid. Consider replacing brake fluid every two years. This keeps them working efficiently and keeps your brake system operating safely for years to come. Be sure to choose the right brake fluid. The owner's manual will tell you what kind to use or go to a trusted mechanic. Please note that mixing brake fluid, using the incorrect formula, or overfilling the brake master cylinder reservoir can cause damage to your vehicle and prevent your brakes from working properly. There are different types of brake fluid and using the correct one is a crucial step for keeping your brakes working properly. You can find the recommended brake fluid type for your vehicle on the brake master cylinder reservoir cap or in your owner's manual. If you can't find it, you can ask an AutoZone associate to help you. Topping off your brake fluid. Determine which brake fluid you'll need. Fluid can be toxic or corrosive, so make sure it doesn't come into contact with your eyes, skin, or any painted part of your vehicle. Top off, then replace the cap, and test your brakes. Common causes of low brake fluid. Typically worn out brake pads or a leak in your system. If levels drop soon after refilling, it's time to check for a leak and repair your brake system. If you're unable to check brake fluid on your own or think you might have a leak, AutoZone can help. AutoZone will help you find the right brake fluid and help you find the repair service you need. And for more helpful tips, be sure to like and subscribe.